Christian. Hey, Corey. Hey, if you're free later, you should stop by. We're having a potluck for New Look Day. What's New Look Day? Well, once a year, me and the guys get together and we sort of create a safe space where we can try out a new look. Something outside of our normal style that we're not really sure we can pull off. Like a puka shell necklace or a cool cowboy hat. Anyway, just give it a trial run and see how it feels before we wear it out in public. That's a great idea. I should put her foot up here and she had zebra print toenail polish. It's driving me crazy, man. So, uh, what are you gonna wear for your new look day? Oh, well, Corey says we're not supposed to talk about our new looks before the party. Says it taints our first impression. Oh, come on. I'll tell you this much, though. I'm going big this year, Frank. And <sighs> I still don't know what I'm gonna wear. I know just what I'm gonna wear. Hey, if you don't mind, maybe I'll bring my mistress along? Well, nothing against Rachel, but Donnie gets a little uncomfortable when you bring around the women with whom you're cheating on your wife with. Totally understandable. Hey, Donnie. I saw you in a picture a couple days ago. My sister and she is two years old. But it must have been the spot. Donnie, if you keep playing that song, you're gonna wear it out. No duh, thanks. Look, no, don't get me wrong. The Walgreens on Highland is slapping. But the one on Sunset is slapping. Okay, cheers, cheers to that. that. So tell me about these dancing lessons. Oh, so I take these lessons. Uh -huh. They're private lessons. Oh, that's a double cheeseburger right there, my boy. Here, Taco here. cheers? Cheers. cheers. Yeah. Was that Annie McDowell? Yeah. She lives in the courtyard. You never saw Sex Lies in the No. Oh, that movie is slapping. Yeah. Did you look there? You look there. Because yeah, Carmen Asada is real thin, you know what I mean? So yeah. you don't got to yeah. marinate it too long. <laughs> wow, this is an incredible spread you guys got here. Oh, thank you. You know he's married, right? All right, everybody listen up. I think we've had enough time to mingle, so why don't we all grab a chair and we can start voting. And if you want any food, grab it now, because I'm gonna throw all this shit away. So I tried wearing the earring. And you also tried not wearing your wedding ring? Oh, that's, that's not a new look. Well, Christian, other than Donnie's vote, it's pretty much a slam dunk. With your confidence in your height, I think you can pretty much pull off anything you want to. Even adultery. Okay, Rachel, you're up. I actually don't feel comfortable being judged by a room full of men and Andy McDowell, so I'm not gonna go up, actually. Okay. Andy, you're up. Okay, I have this uh, new look necklace that I got at Chanel to wear to the Emmys, and I thought I could just wear it every day. Andy, do you mind if we just touch the necklace? No, you can, here. How much is the necklace worth? Four thousand dollars. This necklace is thick. It's got some back on it, I like that. Mm. Got a petite chain though, I like that too. It's cute. Andy, the necklace was shiny, dense, heavy, and it looked very expensive. Mm. But unfortunately, you didn't pull it off. Huh, really? It's just a bit much. You already sparkle. Rachel, I'm gonna give it to you. Here you go, baby. Oh my god. So
so um, I don't know if I'm breaking the rules, like I might be being a bad boy right now, but I didn't try a new look. I tried a new word. I don't know if you guys noticed earlier, but I've been saying slapping. I try to use it organically in conversation at least once with each and every one of you. So. You did. I can give you an example too if you like. Uh, like, uh, ask me what I think of that tapestry. What do you think of that tapestry? Well, slap it. Brent, your new word, slapping, was slapping. You pulled it off. Slap. Okay, Kevin, you're up next. So, uh, I just tried the name Eric. I don't know. <laughs> I didn't know him before, so I just assumed his name was Eric. So I'm just not really sure how to vote. I haven't really been counting your votes anyway, sweetheart. He's up. She doesn't know she wasn't invited. Kevin, you pulled it off. Congratulations, Eric. Oh, fuck. Oh, come on. You fucking with me? Oh, fuck. Fuck. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Come on, Eric. Sit back down. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Frank, is this a new look or a new identity? I don't know. Okay, well, I mean, I'm sure I speak for Salvo when we say just, you know, do you. Uh, but I think we could judge the dress. You didn't pull off the dress. Oh. Somebody wrote the accessories don't match the pattern. I wrote that. It's all good. Okay, so I tried the mustache and the cowboy hat. And can you please turn for me? That chin ain't that thick though. Corey, well, first off, I just wanted to say, you've been crashing on my couch for a while now, and I know how that can make someone feel like it's their personal space. And in a way, you let us in your living room, and hell, you hosted us tonight, and I, don't know, I just think that's really cool. No problem, it was absolutely my pleasure. So anyways, I tallied the votes and read the comments, and the mustache, he didn't pull it off. So the mustache goes. Well, actually, the mustache stays until the rest of the beard grows back and fastens itself back to the rest of it. And the cowboy hat, he didn't pull it off either. Sorry, big guy. Okay. Hey, that's what building day's for. Appreciate all your honest feedback. Corey. <laughs> so, I tried the straight hair, this Burberry scarf here, and just this hustle tattoo on my neck. Some of the guys at the tennis court gave it to me because they always say I hustle. And it is permanent, but don't let that sway your vote. I could easily hide it or get it removed. Sorry if my straight hair is a little shocking. I realize it does change my essence a bit. Okay, let's tally these up. I like your curls better. Look like a character from Fraggle Rock. I live with you and I can't stand to look at it, so no. Well. Sorry, sport. You didn't pull off the straight hair. Or the Burberry scarf. And dang it, Donnie, you know I don't like you hanging out with those guys at the tennis courts. But, I think I speak for us all when I say they did one hell of a job with that tattoo. You pulled it off, pal. Congratulations. It's enough, right? Let me get the curls popping, my oh, boy. No, I think I'm gonna change my name back to Kevin. Oh, Andy, take us for the necklace. Oh.
No problem. Hey, Cor. Oh, hey, pal. Hey, you wanna watch a movie or something? Oh, I don't think so. I just took a sleeping pill a few minutes ago. Probably just hit the sack. I took one too, if you wanna stay up and fight it together. Maybe we can trip out. I don't think I got that kind of fight in me tonight, pal. Okay. Good night, Cor. Hey, Corey, I found this in the bathroom. Is this your...